minute or two. Oh, oh, maybe we're ready now. Mods ready, looks like. <sighs> I don't know if you can tell, but she's purring her little head off. And she, her fur is cold because she was out in my catio. You all know she's been practically living in, hi Nance, she's been practically living in my house. Yes, you. <laughs> and uh, my granddaughter loves her to pieces and she's an excellent, excellent house kitty. So, Sastria leaves today. Hang on. Zastria originally arrived here July 12th and she was uh, parked in the our parking lot in a big big crate with uh, three kittens and she was obviously very pregnant at that time here you gotta be still now gotta be still and here to go potty let me stick her in the room for a minute She's been sleeping out on our catio for probably a good, oh, quite a while. So she might have to go potty. So when she arrived, um, she we put her down as a year and a half. Here's a picture, and she's so cute. Yeah, she weighed seven pounds, 14 ounces at that time. And uh, as you know, she's all white with some black markings and black ears and that black tail with a white tip on it so so cute but her three kitties were, have long been um, adopted she looks like nugget <laughs> has long ago been adopted and as you all know um, she had been pregnant when she came in and unfortunately we lost the babies um, it was just a sad situation um, dr. Darcy did get involved with that and we found a few answers on it but it is what it is, but Zastria then um, realized she didn't have to take care of any kitties and she became a kitty acting cat. Just playing and throwing toys up in the air and she loves her catnip and those uh, yow bananas, she loves that. So then someone that we know very well here um, had adopted a cat from us and that kitty had then passed and um, she waited a little bit and then was eager to have another cat friend in her home and she asked me about about uh, Zastria and so she's been waiting for Zastria she's got things ordered for her and she's got toys and all kinds of fun things for her at her house so she's on her way here right now and um, because of the scare of uh, worry I should say of the COVID um, she doesn't want to come in she's a she's just a little leery about it as we all are so we try to work around people and um, we're very careful when we do our adoptions but for this one I'm going to take Zastria first out to her in the carrier and put her in the car and then I'll have her health record with me and I'll stand back I told her we would be very respectful of her worries and go over her health paper with her. Um, but Zastria is gonna be the only cat and she's got a world of toys and fun things there for her and I think she's gonna be really super duper spoiled as the way she thinks she should be. Zastria is the kind of girl that uh, likes all the attention and wants to be the center of attention. So I'm really, really happy for her. Yeah. So, you know, she had dropped down to six pounds, 12 ounces um, when after her second litter. And then yesterday when I weighed her, she was up to eight pounds, five ounces, and that's a super good weight for her. 
So I always like her on her her right side is always is all white, and then her left side she has that little black blotch on it. Um, just such a pretty cat. Yeah, she's gonna she's gonna have a good a good good home. Super duper wonderful lady. I love this lady. I'll get her here. See what she's got. Oh, you did have to go body. Oh, you did have to go body. She did have to potty. See, so this is white, and this one she's got the black blob on it, and then her goofy tail, black tail with the white tip on it. Yeah, and she's burned her little head off again. Yeah, you know we love all these cats. They're every single one of these kitties and cats, and they're all hard to let go. But the whole objective of, of this is to get them in their very own home. This is fun here and it's very loving here and calm most of the time. And um, they have a good life here, but their own personal homes are what we want. Yeah, lots and lots of love and toys, just like Dark Hat said. All right, you wanna get down and run around? Do not go someplace and take another nap or I won't find you. <laughs> You're the best, aren't you? My daughter, granddaughter Gracie just loves her. All right, don't go, don't go too far. She'll be here probably in about 10 minutes. <laughs> no, stop. Here we go. And I've got her adoption bag all packed and it's got extra, I put a few extra um, catnip toys in it also. Yeah, oh, Mayor Beth, thank you for rescuing. Yeah, right now there's about three or five or 50 that's tucking at my heart. <laughs> Love to take them off. Oh. And that is her. Hello. Hi. Hi, this is 